Hey guys, this is a short video on the key concepts of end diastolic volume, end systolic volume, stroke volume, when it's return, after load and preload. Okay, so these terms are very important to understand in order to comprehend the concept and relations of blood pressure. So let's start. In this pic, you can see four stages and in stage one, the bottle is in the relaxed state or in diastole and it is being filled by water. This water is the when it's return which is coming from the tissues. Now, in stage 2, the volume of water present by the end of diastole is the end diastolic volume. This volume produces a load on the walls of the bottle which is called the preload. Next is stage 3, the bottle gets contracted as a result of which the water is pumped out. This pumped out water is basically the stroke volume and the load against which the water is pumped out is the afterload. Finally, we come to stage 4 where whatever volume of blood is left in the bottle is basically called the end systolic volume. This is about it. So now just replace the word water with blood and uh, bottle with ventricle and you're good to go. Um, in the end, I just wanted to add that these are obviously not the formal definitions. And for the formal definitions, refer to your textbooks or the internet. I hope this video helped. Like, comment, subscribe.